I realize this is a difficult question for you to deal with right now, but do you have any reason to think your wife was involved with another man? Maybe somebody she was meeting on a regular basis at that bungalow? No, I don't think anything of the kind. Listen, Inspector, you can say what you want about me, but how about leaving my memories of my wife alone? Try not to take offense at everything I ask. I do have to ask. Were you faithful to her? Yes. Do you know she was planning to divorce you? What? Where would you ever get an idea like that? From her lawyer? Simpson? Yes. Well, he's lying. Well, he told me that she'd come to him exactly uh, 14 days before she died and asked him to initiate divorce proceedings. He told her to wait a while and think about it. I can't believe that. She had no reason. Another interesting thing, he explained to me that since Madeline died intestate, which means she uh, had no will, everything she owned will go to you. But had she lived to see the divorce through, that would not have been the case. Oh, I see. So therefore, naturally, I'm a suspect, right? People have been known to uh, kill for money, and she was a wealthy woman. Inspector, you police are so used to dealing with base emo emotions that you suspect them in everyone. Not at all. I'm just trying to share with you what I know. I haven't drawn any conclusions. Good. Well, let's all hope you don't draw the wrong ones. Now, it's getting kind of late. This may take a while. Can you tell me where you were in the uh, week or so preceding Madeline's death? Of course. Look, I don't see what that long a period of time uh, makes that much difference, but I, I can account for almost every minute uh, of my time. I, I left Hong Kong and I went home to Boston. Uh, I had some personal matters to take care of. I was there for a few days and I went to New York. I was there on business and that's where I heard about Madeline. I came right out here. Really? What now? Well, forgive me, uh, Mr. Laurent, but I've never met a man who could be in two places at the same time. And I know you were in Santa Barbara the day before the murder.